night. Desire. a story about a philosopher who spends his spare time around children so he can grab their tops in spin.
To catch a top still spinning makes him happy for a moment in his belief that the understanding of any detail, that of a spinning top, for instance, was sufficient for the understanding of all things. running breathlessly after it, the hope would turn to certainty. Spring flowers, it puts the heart squeezes in my spring flowers. Chest, chest, chest. But when he held this silly piece of wood in his hand, he felt nauseated. to compose for voices with war on our doorstep. Sappho's words describing desire seem to fit. Tongue breaks. No speaking is left in me. When I started composing, the world was regaining hope. Hope. The piece was about desire. And wings. And paradox. And metaphor. My mind was on fire with the brilliant words of Sappho and Anne Carson. And then, that day, that man began. And no more words. This is not a film. Not a pandemic. Not a story. Not a, a metaphor. metaphor. It's, it's a circle. Repeating itself. A circle. Again. Not again. Again. Not again. No. No more. No. Not again. No. No more. No. Not again. No. No more. No more than the bird with the piercing voice. Shall we sleep? Not a film. Not a pandemic. Not, Not a story. Not a metaphor. It's a circle. A circle. Tongue breaks. No speaking is left in me. Even in another 
time.